Unlike a gasoline vehicle, today, you can't just drive your electric car off the lot and charge it up anywhere. You'll have the best experience if you are set up to charge at home before you get your car. Most electric vehicles come standard with a charger that can plug into a 240 volt outlet, like you'd have for a stove or dryer. This will typically charge the vehicle at the fastest rate possible using level two charging. You can plug the charger that came with your car directly into that 240 volt plug. But for the most convenience, you should install a charger at home that charges at the same rate as the charger that comes with the car. You might need a qualified electrician to evaluate your home's infrastructure and install any upgrades required for vehicle charging. What about charging on a road trip? For the fastest charging, look for DC fast charging or level three charging, which fills your EV a lot more quickly than a level two charger will. It's best to use level three chargers for convenient charging on long trips rather than daily charging. If used too frequently, they can slightly diminish your battery's capacity over time. Batteries in an electric car work best under optimal temperature conditions, especially when it comes to charging. Ideal charging takes place somewhere between 60 and 80 degrees Fahrenheit. So activating your electric car's battery preconditioning feature before you arrive at a charger will ensure the fastest charge times. A nearly empty battery will charge faster than a nearly full one. So plan to drive longer distances between fast charging stops and precondition the battery before each stop to save the most time. Like all cars, cold weather can also reduce efficiency and range. To minimize the loss of range during winter driving, be sure to keep correct tire pressure, use the eco setting on your EV's HVAC system, preheat the car while it's plugged in, and use the seat and steering wheel heaters to keep warm. Not all these driving tips apply to every car or every climate. Try them out one by one to see the impact they have on your range and find the techniques that work best for you. And if you have any other great EV driving tips, please share them here with us in the comments. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get recommendations for other useful content on green cars and how they can work best for you.